All right, well, this will be my typical breakfast most days of the week. So I'm sure you'll get tired of seeing my post of my smoothie every day. <laughs> but so here is, well, let's show you what I'm doing here. This is coconut unsweetened coconut milk. So when you look at the label, total sugar zero includes zero grams of added sugars. And sometimes you can get these with a vanilla flavor, um, depending on the brand, without sugar. But you have to be really careful because some of the vanilla plant milks are sweetened. So I'm always very cautious to get unsweetened. I never do the sweetened one anyway, because I don't need extra sugar for even normal life. So anyway, I'm gonna put in oh, maybe about that much. Sometimes I add more depending on the thickness. Then I love a little tang. So I'm gonna put in some of the apple cider vinegar and I'm doing this with one hand. So you wanna shake up that mother. If you're not familiar with that meat, what that means, there's the stuff at the bottom that they call the mother, and that is really good for you. It's got the probiotics, so, but you wanna shake it up because it likes to settle into the bottom. So let's see, I like, if you don't like tang, then I would leave that out. Now, normally I use a protein powder, but that protein powder has, and it has a vanilla flavor to it, but it does have stevia. So since I'm avoiding stevia, I am going with some vanilla extract to give it a little flavor. So I'm just gonna squirt in. I don't even know how much because I don't normally do that. Now here is my smoothie bucket <laughs> and smoothie bin that I keep in the freezer. This has frozen kale, frozen mango, and a little bit of frozen banana. I will sometimes sub out blueberries or some other combination of things. And I'm gonna add that to the blender. And so let's see what happens. I can't do this with one hand, so hold on. Okay, there it is. Plug your ears. If you have headphones on, go ahead and mute me because this is about to go down. Sometimes I keep going. Nope, that looks like it's pretty good. So I'll pour that into a glass and that will be my breakfast. Now, does that look appetizing? <laughs> Probably not. All right, so I like to drink it out of a mason jar. And this one is a little smaller than what I normally do. So feel free to double up on your kale and fruit and things like that. But I'm going to start with this and see how I feel. But definitely, maybe I'm going to do a whole nother one. So, all right. So there we go. A sugar detox type of breakfast.